being health conscious by cutting calories with diet soda? Well, think again. That's right. Some studies now suggest that those calorie-free colas, they can cause cell damage and kickstart kidney problems. Seven is on your side tonight with the details. Here's Pamela Brown. Some people hate it. It's gross. Others love it. it to me, sometimes it's like a little treat. And some can barely go a day without it. Diet Pepsi. Five times a week. But does that bubbly beverage with zero calories really do a body good? What some people call a mad scientist dream. So it's a whole group of chemicals that have been put together by a chemist, and we're drinking it. Many doctors, like Patricia Davidson at Washington Hospital Center, try to steer people away from artificially sweetened diet drinks. There has been a suggestion in a Harvard study of over 3,000 women that there was an increase in, in, um, in abnormalities in the kidney. Other studies indicate cell damage and reproductive issues, messed up metabolism, and obesity could be linked to diet drinks. Not well proven, but usually seen in, in, in small rat studies, but um, has not been proven in humans yet. But again, with all these suggestions of, of what these chemicals are doing to our body, then um, water is your best liquid. Most doctors say the biggest problem with diet soda, the artificial sweetener actually makes you crave more food. One more potential problem, an Australian study indicates cocktails made with diet cola can actually worsen a hangover because the chemicals in diet drinks cause your body to absorb the alcohol much faster. Pamela Brown, ABC 7 News.